Let's take a quick look at how fast and easy it is to get set up and start using PicChamp Online. When you sign up for your account, you'll receive an email message that gives you all the information you need to get your account set up and to start using PicChamp Online. That's really very easy. First, just click the web link that's in the email attachment. That takes you to a website where you download and run a very small application on your computer. What this application does is install desktop icon that's pre-programmed to take you directly to the PicChamp secure servers that house your PicChamp database. And it's just that easy. You're ready to go with PicChamp Online. So now you have the PicChamp Online icon on your desktop. And when you click that icon, you'll need to put in the username and password that was provided in the email message. When you push connect, it will take you directly to PicChamp. So now you're in the PicChamp application. So nothing else is installed on your computer, but you can do your data entry, you can run your reports, and you can do some things that are fairly unique for a program that's accessed through the internet. So for example, I might want to run a whole bunch of reports at one time. So every quarter I have a group of reports I need to run. There's quite a few there, so I'm gonna run them all at the same time. And I know that's gonna take a little while, but what I can do with PicChamp Online is I can multitask. I can enter data, I can review other reports that I've already run. So here's an example of the fairing control chart where we can see some of the other functionality that's unique to PicChamp and to PicChamp Online. One of those is the ability to drill down on reports. So here I'm looking at a fairing control chart, I see an abortion, I may want to see more information on that sow. So I can see the identity, and basically I can see all of her events. So I can do that type of drill down reporting on pretty much all of the reports on PicChamp. So anytime I see data, either individual or aggregated, I have the ability to look at what animals make up that data set, which really allows me to do quite a bit more of analysis than I can just from the simple report itself. I also have the ability, and let me pull up a lactation length analysis report here. So I can see this report shows me lactation length versus live born, uh, lactation length uh, versus stillborn, mummified. There's a lot of information on this report. But what I might want to do is to drill down a little bit farther say, okay, I want to see what makes up this data. I want to see why there's an outlier there. So I can click again any one of these data points and see the individual animals and the history that makes up that data point. The other thing that I can do in PigChamp is to filter these reports. So let's say I want to filter a report by parity. And for this particular report, I want to look at uh, only the animals that have parity that's equal to or greater than four. So I'm going to add that filter, and when I push OK, then I'm seeing the chart with only my over parity for animals. However, if I want, I can also look at that data compared to the entire herd information. So by filtering, I can do a lot more analysis. And here again, if I want, I can drill down and see exactly what animals make up the data set that I'm looking at. So tremendous powerful tools. And of course, I can print to my local printer. I can save. I can email directly from PicChamp online. I can minimize PicChamp online, and then I can do other work. So if I need to do something else on my computer, do that, but I can always come back to my PicChamp online. So it's a powerful tool, and if you need any additional information, we'd be very happy to talk to you.